Hey folks, it's Kurt from Whitetails Deer Hunting, and today I'm going to show you how I take this hang on tree stand and turn it into this. I'm going to show you guys now what I did to this hang-on stand to make it a bit more camouflaged. Being a mobile hunter and taking hang-on stands out into the woods, it's real difficult to hide from deer. Unless you're in a cedar tree or another pine tree or have some real back cover with multiple stems, uh, this hang-on stand just stands out like a sore thumb. So the first thing I did was went ahead and did the four color sponge paint job on the entire metal part of the tree stand itself. And then after that, I went ahead and put the double layer of burlap underneath so it's more difficult for a deer underneath you to see your feet moving around or your bow or even adjusting the camera. I'm going to take some old burlap that I have here, some zip ties and scissors, and I'm going to go ahead and attach this burlap to the underside. First thing I'm going to do is take this camouflage netting and I'm going to double it up a little bit here just to make it a little bit more difficult for deer to see through it. And then once I approximately have it where I want it, take my scissors if I can find them. Doesn't have to be a clean cut by any means. We want it to look kind of irregular anyways underneath the stand. Very simply, I'm gonna take some zip ties and go ahead and zip tie this burlap the actual stand itself. We'll start just in the four corners. Again, like I said, I'm doubling it up. And the reason that I'm doubling it up is I want to go ahead and make it as difficult as possible for deer to be able to see any movement of my feet or moving my bow or camera or anything else. got to make sure as well too that you don't accidentally strap in the cable so you got to make sure the zip tie is on the frame not on the cable that connects the actual base of the stand to the seat and there it is real simple just went ahead put burlap underneath the stand just to make it a little bit more difficult for deer to see your feet moving around or me moving the camera or getting my bow ready as a buck or doe comes in to get a shot at them. If you take a look, being that it's doubled up, actually does make it pretty difficult to see through it. Yep. The third thing I have here is from High Point Products in Pennsylvania. It's a 3D camouflage leaf system which adjusts forward and backward it adjusts right and left and you can put these closer and further away and it just provides a little bit of breakup to help you maybe have that extra second or two to get ready to get a shot at a deer this fall I'll put a link in the description below of the tree stand 3D camouflage product from High Point Products. They not only have this fall foliage color, but they also have a green coloration for hunting in early September and October.